Alrighty. After you take the paper and everything off your pot, you want to squeeze the pot to loosen the dirt around the edges. Pop it up a little bit because you want the you want, is, want the dirt to stay in the place as much as possible. And you take your plant, and you just put it right in the hole. Alrighty. Then loosely by hand, you want to get the right height. And just move your dirt in by hand nice and easy. Okay. Alrighty. Make sure you get it nice and even all the way around. Nice loose dirt. This way it adheres to the plant. Okay, let's get the Alrighty. Alrighty. After you move the dirt nice and loosely. Okay, and you got it in there. Alright, now normally people would think, oh now I'm gonna pat the pat the dirt down. Well, that's not what you're gonna do. What you're gonna do is you're gonna get your hose and you're gonna sprinkle the water all over the area and get the loose dirt inside the hole to mix with the potted plant so that it'll uh, so that it'll take root and hopefully live a long productive life in the ground. Let me go get the hose. Hold on. Okay. Oop. Let me go turn the water on. <laughs> Can't believe I forgot to turn the water on. Oh. Nobody ever accused me of being the sharpest knife in the drawer, but I'll still make you bleed. Let's turn this water on. Alrighty. Uh, let's get back and finish the job. Alrighty. Okay, turn. You want to make sure that your water is not too strong because you don't want to do damage to the plant. And work your dirt towards the work your, work your dirt towards the uh, the plant and this is how you get your point setter in the ground nicely and properly Oop, sorry about that all righty then you can do a little groundwork to spruce it up, make it look a little bit nicer. And that's how you put a poinsettia, or any plant for that matter, replanting it in the ground. Thank you.